Yes. So, so we have decided to carry on doing this burglary quest. We went to Markarth, we took the carriage straight from Riften. So you haven't really missed much. Are we just going to head into... Well actually that's, that's, a, that's a shop. We want to go to the inn. We've got a mission to finish here of course. We need to go and give the owner of Silver Blood Inn a agreement form. The guy from the, the fisheries. Inn has plenty of strong drink and clean rooms. Hello, Clapper. This is the Silver Blood Inn. I'll let you figure out who owns it by yourself. I'd like some water, please. And I've got a purchase ah, agreement from I you. Holy finally got someone out here. Well, it's about time. I've been waiting for weeks. Well, thank you for bringing it, I suppose. Have a good day. I'm supposed to have some money. What? Oh. Oh, how could I have possibly forgotten? Mm, Your I reward, think of course. Red and stew of here. course. Guess we won't here you are. It, so sorry about that. A silver ingot, a corundum ingot, and an iron ingot. Have you seen a Khajiit bard or the Cyrodiil dogwood flute? As you said, the caravana. Rissad, the caravana. That's well fitted in actually. Rissad. Okay. Ale is cheaper than blood in What we want to do, we've got this this quest which is the well let's click on the villagers missing flute. And the burglary job. We need to go and do a burglary job. We'll just tell Villager to wait do here. Think I look fat in this outfit? Mm, no. Uh, of course not. So? You look lovely. Blah Thank blah blah. Let's give her a drink. Oh, how sweet of you. Uh, we'll give her some mead. Oh, I like that. That's cheap. That's nothing like a good drink when one is thirsty. Ah, oh, this is so relaxing. Thank you. Oh, she didn't go and dance. Sometimes she just decides to go and dance. I'm just going to tell her to relax here for a while. Good idea. Because we need to go and sneak and sneak around, go find something. We need to go to this smelter's overseer's workshop and. I expect that to actually be here somewhere. No, obviously not. This is well outside Marker. Markarth, as they say. All these burglary quests, what they do is they gradually improve the Thieves' Guild over time. Although I didn't like the Thieves' Guild to start off with, I put so much effort into it and they've leveled up my character to 1 to 10, giving me some decent armour. I almost feel that I, I should invest some time into them. Well, this is Markarth from the outside. And the smelter's workshop is quite far away, obviously. West of here. I'm confused now. Ah, the problem is, is that it was directing me to go to another quest I should have gone to. It's inside, Markarth, I'm sure of it. A few spells. Am I supposed to be in Ah, let's go in here. The reason I'm confused is that there's arrows at the top of the screen telling me where to go and it's telling me to go outside again no let's find Riasad, oh, of course I've got I've still got the villagers quest active no but this is this is the mine, silver mine, so I expect the smelter is going to be over here
this is the house. Let's see if I get caught out here. He hasn't noticed me. He's still doing some of his cooking. Well, that's a job well done. That's a bit of a fetch and carry. Incredibly that's easy, I gotta say. Of course, I could have stolen a bit more. Wasn't gonna push my luck though. Didn't even need to do any lock picking or anything else. That was incredibly easy. Outsiders aren't trusted in Narkar. Just keep that in mind. Sounds like Arnold Schwarzenegger. Come on in. The Silverblood Inn has plenty of strong drink. We need to go and find Rissard. So we'll go and we'll go and grab Vilia. There she is, she's hanging over there. Yes? Let's go. I'm not gonna give you another of drink. Course. If Rassad isn't too far out, what we'll do is we'll just go and find ourselves a carriage and go back to Riften. But that was much quicker than I actually thought it would be. I thought there would be a bit of a protracted quest to go and find, but that burglary was really straightforward. Hmm, this is a giant. What quest do I have open? I'm confused. Vilya's... Let's switch that off. Vilya's missing flute. So Rissard is around here somewhere. This Khajiit. That's something I'd like to talk to you about. What are you going to say? Go on, what are you going to say? That's something I'd like to talk to you about. Go on, what are you going to say? You haven't forgotten about the ingredients you promised to help you find, have nope. you? Nope. Nope, small pearl. I wonder if we're strong enough to face up to people now. It's a possibility. I did look in the unofficial Elder Scrolls page and I did actually find out where I'd be able to pick up a small pearl. This is a farm just outside of Markarth. I'm so glad that you're here to track down Now I thought that Khajiit wouldn't be too far away, but obviously I'm wrong. When it says find Rissard, he's all the way over here. In Whiterun. Now that's not good. You mustn't forget to ask around for it among Khajiit's bards and innkeepers. Now we found him, so we know exactly where he's going to go. <laughs> what we're going to do now is we're going to just speak to this guy up here, Kibble. Traveling in the reach is dangerous. You need a good carry. Where do you want to go? Let's go back to Riften. Climbing back and we'll be off. No, 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 actually. City of Markarth, sure is it. Where do you want to go? Let's go to Whiterun and let's find. Climbing back and we'll be off. It's on the, supposedly on the way. That's a stupid place to put the nest. I eat myself a eh, bird fetus. Disgusting. Like one of those. What do you call it? Some of the in the Philippines or is it Thailand? They have a, a bird fetus. They eat a chicken fetus. Balut, I think. Balut. Similar to that. 
I don't know why a bird would end up laying their egg on the ground anyway. It's not exactly a safest place. But then again, my character is quite a merciless character. Kills a lot of people. So, I need to get food soon. Thirsty. Let's drink ourselves some wine. Let's have ourselves a venison chop. Let's have ourselves some boiled water. Let's have some ourselves some bread. Haven't slept for about three days, so he should collapse at any time. Let's go and find Rissad. Oh, here he is, here he is. Will the honey room immediately be a better place now? With Malus Machia. Hello, folk. Aren't you supposed to have a camp I'm somewhere? Hello, Rissad. The wind blows bitter cold in this place. I'm gonna step on your tail. I wanna step on your tail. Ah. Khajiit as wares, if you have coin. Have you seen a Khajiit bard with a Cyrodiil dogfoot ward flute? Of course, Rissad knows Lassie and its magic flute. Lassie is Rissad's second cousin. Yes, Lassie has played the magic flute for us. But Racine needs to walk on warm sand, not hard stones like in Marka. Racine wanted a smoother soil than here. Zara, Racine cannot be found here anymore. Search for my second cousin, Rift. That is where his feet wanted to wander. Okay, so Racine's second cousin has got the flute, and he didn't want to hang around Markarth, he wanted to go to Riften. Well, handy, I want to go to Riften in a second as well. So, what has he got for <laughs> sale anyway? But that was very well done. Hmm, what have we got? We can buy a yellow dress if we want to adopt. Major lockpicking, I've got that already. Skooma. Steel plate gauntlets of eminent alchemy. That's quite hard. Some of the stuff is quite handy. Hmm. Grand soul gems. Look at all that. I don't need anything to do with lock picking because of course I've got the skeleton key. And I've already got a shock thing that I need to break down. Steel plate gauntlets of eminent arch alchemy. I might get that at some point. Interesting. Your road leads you to warm sands. Let's get to Riften. That's where we want to end up going anyway. One reason I'm feeling so stingy is that I actually want to go and buy myself a house in Whiterun. It sounds silly, doesn't it? Why on earth do you want a house? Because, in essence, why am I paying 5,000 gold for a house when it only costs 20, 20 gold, or even, I think it's 10 gold to stay in an inn, so I'd have to spend 500 days in inns to balance out. But it's nice to have a house. I've got about 4,000 gold in my end dresser in the Thieves Guild Hall and I've got about 1,000 on my person. And of course I've got tons of treasure as well so as a career as a thief and bounty hunter I've done quite well for myself. Could be time to retire. Lazy to walk, eh? well, you found the right place. I need water now. Let's drink. Well, we'll just go to the inn and get some water. Why not? Fortunately, like I say, I don't ever die. Someone's running around. Why is that guy running around? In a bit of a hurry. 
Yeah, I'm just going to go in this inn, pick up some water. What I might mod in next time, I might mod in the fact that... Look, I already said Shadra doesn't know me a thing. So get oh, who are you talking to, Lizard? Oh, it's you again. What in blazes do you... Look at all this custom I'm giving you. I'm just buying water. I'm such a cheapskate. Take a look. We want some beef. It's apple. That'll do. Doors over there. Oh, she was. I guess because I extorted some money out of her, she isn't pleased. Understandable. Use it. Obviously, I, I feel a bit like dropping down. Let's go and speak to this Khajiit over here. Look at him. What a cheap price of ruining the life of some nice rich Do you want something, friend? So I want. He said, "Do you want something, friend? Can we talk about your flute?" Oh yes, Latin. Art of Skyrim. It is made of Cyril Dogwood. It's very it's precious. Will Sarah listen to your flute? I'd be happy to listen to your flute. My pleasure. Let's hear you play your flute. No flute animation. <laughs> That's so cool. <coughs> that is so cool. He's taken your flute. I hope you don't mind. He couldn't accuse. Kajit, you can't really accuse of stealing anything. Look at him. No, 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 no. I want to talk to you. Oh, yes. Latin has the best flute in all of Skyrim. It is made of Cyril Dogwood and it's very precious. Will Sarah listen to the flute? That flute's not yours. Sarah? It is my flute. I have bought it in Solstein from a fine swordsman. I had paid for it with my own money. Well, almost. <laughs> Anyone say that your flute does not belong to Racine? The man who sold you the flute had stolen it. Sarah? It cannot be true. The man looked very honorable. Ah, it is true, isn't it? Racine has been fooled. Yes, yes, Racine could feel that in his bones. The flute does not belong to Racine. Therefore, it will not play the way Racine wants it to play. So, tell me, who is the owner of the flute? The flute belongs to my companion Vilya. It's a gift from her grandmother. So, can we then please have the flute? Well, that is not possible. A bard needs to have a flute to play. And the Racine hasn't got another flute. There was a flute, but it is gone. 
What happened to your other flute? Oh, it is a sad, sad tale. Rasil should have listened to his mother, who always said gambling is bad. But Rasil didn't listen. Rasil wanted to play put that tail on the donkey with a little wooden fellow and a big nod for him. Racine lost. Racine had no money, so instead Racine gambled with the old flute. It now belongs to the little wooden fellow. What if I buy you a new flute? No, no that wouldn't do. Racine wants his old flute. <laughs> it's all about the flutes. Blah blah blah, what happened to your other flute? Okay, right, we've what heard that. Racine had no money. So what if I retrieve your old flute? Ooh, then Racine would be very happy. Then Racine no longer needs the new flute. Then you may buy it. Then he can has he has to buy the flute. I have to buy the flute anyway. That's fair enough. Racine didn't know it was stolen. Sarah, Racine has paid 500 gold for the flute. 500 gold for a flute? Okay, I'll retrieve that flute for you. Sarah, that is very kind. Racine's old flute is a very good flute. You must then find the little wooden fellow and his big note friend. They say they will go into Riverwood. You might want to ask around there. In Riverwood, so the big Nord fellow. Walk on Warren and the Wood Elf. Elf. It's those two again who originally stole the bottle. Do you want something, friend? So we have to go and find them again. Well, that's quite a, a handy aside. But we're going this way anyway. Sometimes I think, why on earth do I need a house anyway? Because I c essentially could live in Mercer Frey's old manor. A little wooden fellow and his big Nord friend. Hmm, doesn't that somehow sound familiar? Well, they're in River Run, Riverwood. Again, I'm mixing up my Game of Thrones terminology with Skyrim. What's on your mind? So let's just rest out here. I'll rest for 16 hours. But yeah, so villagers quest so we've gone past the first quest that was to find the missing bottle pick that up once we pick that up then we had to go and what else do we have to do after that she had another quest for us I can't quite remember it what was that quest well there's an ingredients an ingredients quest anyway that we had to do we pick those up. She gives us quite a few tasks. If we look at the villagers' little quests. All these are the main quests. Companion Villa, there we go. The quests were travel, well, Travel with Villa to Elder Green Sanctuary. Deliver a note. Deliver a book. Gather ingredients. Pick up another book. Find an ally of Saber Cat. Find a mushroom. Now we are going to have to find her flute. So it feels quite epic. She's her her main her quest is. Pretty much as big as uh, the Thieves Guild quest. Need 
something. What I'm actually going to do with the basic needs quest is basic needs mod. I'm going to mod it myself since I'm a little bit more competent with the creation kit than I first thought. As I'm going to make mead and wine give you additional boosts. While we are here, maybe not realist, not not too game changing boosts, but what I'm going to try and make them do is I'm going to make them quench a bit more thirst than water. I'm also going to try and make them quench a bit of food or a bit of hunger as well and also quench a bit of tiredness. Although that of course that sounds a bit opposite to what you might expect. You would you would obviously just expect alcohol to make you sleepy. Yeah, you but basically what I want is I want wine to be worthwhile using. Of course, uh, I won't be hey. drinking wine all the time because wine gives the bad effect of making you dizzy, so you can't have too much. But it'll make drinking on? mead and drinking wine worthwhile rather than just being a complete waste of time, which it is now. Oh, yes, we were going to pick up some food as well. What have we got to eat? Tomatoes? Venison chop? And I have to add some food values to meat pies and seared slaughterfish. Let's hurry to Riverwood. Who knows? Maybe that wood elf fellow will lose that food on gambling just as easily as he won it. Yeah, so that Khajiit that we spoke to, what he said, he actually gambled away his flute. And what we need to do is retrieve his old flute, then pay him five hundred gold for the privilege. Of actually retrieving Vilja's old flute. Sounds like a completely rubbish deal, but that's what we've got to live with. Keep on getting lost. I keep on getting lost, that's the practice room. I don't like this place, and I wouldn't trust anyone here. That's right, we have to go through this door, we keep on thinking. What I keep on thinking, I keep on thinking this is the Ratway, vo ratway Vault and that's going to lead us somewhere where we don't want to go yet. So we have picked up this nice item for Vex. This jeweled flagon which is worth nothing because it's a quest item. Hi there Vex. Well, you done or what? I've completed the burglary job. Oh, you're back? I suppose you'll be wanting your pay then. 250 gold. Nice. Let's see if we can get some extra work. I handle the burglary. If you don't like that kind of work, yep, talk to Yeah, we'll, ta we'll handle that. Let's do some more burglary. Pretty simple. Break into a house, grab a specific item, and get out before they realize what's going on. The catch is you can't kill anyone who lives there, or you forfeit the payment. You ready for some good old-fashioned burglary? Sure. I'm in, again. Oh, here's everything you need to know. Started the burglary job again. And what's our quest? Retrieve the jeweled pitcher from Carlotta Van Lettier's house in Whiterun. And we want to go there anyway, so we'll take that job. We'll take that job. I think Percy Honey has really unhappy with what Steve Skid is doing. I'm going to take that off you. You don't mind, do you, Delvin? Ha! Ah. Okay. So that's pretty good going. What I want to do in White Run as well is. Search, l take out all my gold and I want to buy myself a nice house. Oh, I've got 6,000 gold. How about that? Let's take 5,000 gold out. As you can see, it's actually increased my... Well, you probably can't see because I've cut off the bottom. But it's, it's increased my weight a little bit, but not too much. I 
wonder if I can if I've got a lot of things that I don't need, silver ingots and things like that. While we are here, maybe we could practice our skills in the training hall. Interest you in some marksman. I could improve my archery. Interest I should do that actually. Yeah, yeah, go ahead. Oh no, you've gone now. But anyway. I do need to improve my archery. I don't think that's a thieves related skill. I don't, not sure, not 100% sure. Oh, it's funny as you play this game, there's lots of little improvements that you could see that they could have made to make it fantastic. Of course, they could actually make all these improvements in updates and they could make all these, in well they can't make all these improvements in retrospect because that would spoil the game for Xbox 360 users. Which obviously is a bit of a shame, it makes it a bit annoying that these people are Xbox 360 users, they hold back PC users. Now we're going to go into the whole the PC the console the debate. But yes, if they made updates each time for people who bought the game and made these updates optional, that's the one thing that you have to do. You should make these updates optional because of course they'll ruin people's save games if they if you made them compulsory. Need a ride? But they could make the game a lot better because you think of you always think Where of extra ideas. Oh, let's see if we can actually go Let to Look at the beautiful horses. Let's get to uh, White Run. Climb and back, and we'll be off. Oh, I mean, you might be thinking, why don't I spend all that money I've got on training? But the thing is, with the skill capping, that your training does—it's it's not what you can't really keep on training. Otherwise, it will ruin your leveling up. I could spend a little bit on smithing, I guess, one or two points, and a couple of points in alchemy, and then a couple of points in archery, and then that's probably a bit better idea than buying myself a house. But I, I want to buy myself a house. There you go. It's my imaginary money, so I'll spend it how I like. And you do get a. Oh, actually, one thing that is terrible about it is that you need to sort out all the furnishings. Now I've slowed all the way down. Let's eat a few things, drink a few things. <coughs> I should actually ride my horse all the way up to... all the way up there. Save myself some time. But then we'll miss this lovely market that I don't really use, but it's quite nice. So we've got another quest here to go and steal something. Let's hurry to Riverwood. We'll walk to we'll get the we might actually get the carriage to Riverwood. It's only a few gold. But we'll do a little bit of a theft to start off with. The cloud district very often. Oh, what am I saying? Of course you don't. Heard they're reforming the Dawn Guard. Vampire eyes. So what? What we're going to do here? We need to go on a burglary job. Let's switch off our miscellaneous quests. Switch off field just loot. We need to go to. Carlotta Val Valnetta's house. Well, that's this way. Come by Bellathor's shop at the market. I'm sure we've got something in Stay out of trouble, Kajit. You, you, Vilya, Vilya, just hang around here. It's so nice to just talk a little, you and I. I Go on, what are you going to say? As I told you, I left Solstheim soon after my grandmother had passed away. I took a ship from Fort Frostmoth to Dawnstar. On the ship I met some nice bards, a storyteller and a red god who was fantastic at playing the lute. 
He promised he would give me lessons, but, uh, well, to tell the truth, I'm the worst landlubber ever. And very soon I got really seasick. I spent most of my time at sea with my head very close to a bucket. It wasn't very pleasant. And I who always used to dream about being a sailor. When we arrived in Dawnstar, the barge just disappeared. Well, to be honest, first we spent an evening at the inn, where we had quite a few beer. I think I taught them how to dance on the table the way we do in Solstein, but I'm not sure. Uh, I'm afraid I can't remember that part so well. Anyway, when I woke up the morning after, they were gone. And the innkeeper seemed to think that it would be a good idea if I left as well. To be honest, sometimes I don't understand the Skyrim Lords. They never seem to dance on the tables or have any fun at all. No wonder they all look so depressed and bitter. You should see the folks back home after a schnapp so poor. They really know how to dance on a table. So you never learn how to play a lute then? Well, I can play a little, but I don't own a lute. Maybe if one day I could afford to buy one. But I still would need lessons. They oh cost no, about four maybe gold. Maybe I run into the red card bard one of these days. And then maybe he could teach me. A red guard bard, okay. Uh, let's say you can relax here for a while. Good idea. While we're getting our things. It might suit you. Well, I wonder exactly what... Now, for anyone who's seen the Dragonborn... Seen the Dragonborn thingy. DLC. I wonder if they know what Solstheim is like. Solstheim is a, a pretty hard country. So let's just save here. And I'll pause it here very quickly because we'll, we've had enough of wandering around and I will reload this the next time.